It's an important day in the Curtis Reeves movie theater murder trial. Today, the jury got an extensive look at surveillance video from inside the theater, and they also heard from Reeves' wife. She was there when her husband shot and killed Chad Olson. And ABC Action News reporter Eric Waxler joins us live with the very latest. Eric? Hey, Wendy, and the defense is trying to prove to this jury that Curtis Reeves felt threatened by Chad Olson and that he shot him because he thought that Olson was going to attack him. Mr. and Mrs. Olson were two to three. With Chad Olson's widow watching in the courtroom, Curtis Reeves' wife Vivian took the stand, saying her husband did complain to Olson over a lit up cell phone during the movie previews, but Olson was the one who was angry, especially when Reeves came back from complaining to theater staff. Did you hear Mr. Olson say something at that Yes. Moment? What did he say? Something to the effect of, you told on me who the F. Only he said the word, do you think you are? Reeves testified Olsen was leaning toward her husband and she thought he was coming at him. And when you observe that motion, how did it make you feel in terms of what it looked like to you? I thought he was coming over and uh, it just freaked me out. I was terrified. Surveillance video appears to show Olson snatching popcorn from Reeves and tossing it back at him. That's when the retired Tampa police captain pulled out his gun and shot Olson, but it does not seem to show Olson lunging forward. Mrs. Reeves, did you at any time ever see Mr. Olson in your aisle? No. Completely over in your no. aisle. Correct? Correct. You never saw him climbing over a chair either, did you? No, sir. I have no further questions, Judge. Vivian Reeves also testified that she actually told her husband that they should move to a different seat, but he did not hear her. Live in Dade City, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.